In crypto, it's normal to have more than one seed phrase. And with your Solana Seeker, you can import multiple seed phrases into the seed vault. I'm going to show you how, and I'm going to go over this question here. How do I switch between the seed vault wallet and the import wallet? I went to the settings, added my import wallet as second wallet, but in seed vault app, I can't switch. That is correct. I'll show you how you can work around this. So firstly, what you want to do is you get yourself into settings if you've got more than one seed phrase. So you come in here, of course, up into settings, and then right at the top is seed vault. So here you can see I've got two different seeds, both in the seed vault. Remember, seed vault is more protection than a typical hot wallet in a sense. Now, if I go into my wallet here, then it is true that I can't switch to my other wallet. So I've got three different addresses and they all come from the same seed phrase. In settings, it says seed phrase one, and there's no way to add a second seed phrase, at least not yet. So we can't add anything like that. There's no options here for us to go ahead and do that. And if we go ahead and add plus, all we're going to do is create another wallet, which is attached to the Seeker seed phrase. So instead, what we can do is we can either go to Soulflare or Phantom, probably even Backpack and other wallets. But I'll show you here with Soulflare. So let's go and grab Soulflare. Here I've already connected the second phrase. So these are all tutorial wallets. And you can see very clearly it says tutorial. And these are all of the different wallet addresses that are derived from that particular seed phrase. And then down the bottom, it says Seeker Seed 1. All we've got in here is just our collectible, which is this one here. It's soul bound. And then I've been staking some soul. Now, let me show you how to do it with Phantom and we'll set it up from scratch. So go to Phantom, agree to the terms, and I can connect the seed vault. I'm going to use biometrics like so. Next, connect to seed, allow, and we'll go with the seeker seed one, and we will go and connect all these addresses, continue, and we are good. Now that's one seed vault connected. Tap on A1, add account, and then connect seed vault, and then tutorial this time, authenticate with your fingerprint, and then it shows you, like Soulflare, all of the wallets that have soul in them. We're gonna go and pull them all in here, anything with a little bit of soul, that would of course mean an active wallet. I do have a few tutorial wallets for sure, and then nothing, account 10, 11, 12. So that's fine, continue. And now tap on A1 and we can see all of the different wallets like that. Now this may work with Jupe Mobile and it may work potentially with Backpack. I just haven't tested it out, so you can check it out. And if you do want this feature to be native in the Seeker wallet, you can go to Discord, open a ticket and request it, but I'm unsure how much of a priority it is. Thanks for watching and remember, if you don't have your Seeker already, make sure you check your emails, confirm your shipping address, pay the shipping, and hopefully you'll get it within the month.